Creativity has always been a part of me my whole life, even before I was born, along with my family, from my mom being a music teacher to my sister being a sneaker artist and me now being a makeup artist. Now, I didn't start makeup off from the beginning. In fact, no one in my family is or has been a makeup artist until now. It started when I was much younger. My mom had made it a rule, no makeup until you turn 13. And in all honesty, it was something I was looking forward to, but not something that blew me away by the thought of it. Once I began makeup, it was all experimental from there. I was limited to social media and what it had to offer about makeup, so I was mostly working with my imagination and what I was taught by my mom. Starting off, I had no direction in makeup and just about slapped it on my face every morning, calling it good. This, of course, pretty much always led to rude comments and others' opinions being expressed a bit too much towards me. I do now appreciate the hate I have received as, as it has helped me grow and improve my skills mentally and physically. Going into high school and continuing to do and collect makeup, it was starting to grow into a passion. As a person who was and is still learning about the creativity in the world, I would receive hate and love for what I was doing. I never let that stop me and would continue to work harder and harder, not only to prove those people wrong, but to make myself proud of what I was doing. Midway through sophomore year, I learned about a high school I could take a cosmetology class at and be able to graduate with a cosmetology license. After lots of paperwork and good grades, I got into the cosmetology course, which only accepts 40 people in the entire program. Now, all the other factors in cosmetology were not something I was super interested in, but I had no future plans, and it was the best I could do to continue my interest in makeup. As I'm about to graduate in a few weeks from school, I plan to keep working in the cosmetology field as best as I can. I also wish to keep growing and learning about the makeup industry as much as I can get my hands on. Being a self-taught makeup artist is a great thing about this job because I learn to grow on my own and teach myself new things every day. Teaching yourself something is a great experience because you teach yourself lessons you may not learn in everyday situations.